Hey fellow foodies, we're back and we're heading next to Colorado. It is known for its lamb chops. First, I have a rack of lamb here and we're going to take out the silver skin which will make it tough to eat but leave most of the fat on there because that will help keep it moist when cooking. And I also love the charred bits when they're cooked properly. Then, I will cut my rack of lamb into chops. The way I'm slicing my lamb chops is I cut in between each rib bone. It's usually on a little bit of an angle so that you don't slice in through the bone. After that, we're going to prepare our marinade. I'm using some simple ingredients that I have on hand. I'm chopping some fresh rosemary. You can also use some parsley or thyme. And I'm also mincing some few cloves of garlic. Then, we'll put that in a bowl and we'll add some kosher salt and black pepper and some olive oil. Mix well and combine and then coat the lamb chops on both sides. Then let it marinate while we heat up our pan. I like using a cast iron pan for this because it retains the heat well and maintains a good temperature throughout the cooking process. Just make sure not to overcrowd your pan when cooking. Place your chops on our pan and cook for 2-3 to three minutes and don't touch it. Then turn it over once and cook for another 2-3 to three minutes. For the perfect lamb chops, the internal temperature should be 130 degrees. Make sure to let it sit for 3-5 to five minutes before serving. I'm serving mine with a bed of garlic mashed potatoes and some green peas. I hope you get to enjoy this simple, easy herb garlic Colorado lamb chop recipe. Please don't forget to click like and subscribe for more of my weekly videos. And as always, thanks for watching!